roundhouse. Tyson Hersher is a gold medal kickboxing champion. I, I never thought this would happen when I started martial arts. But it has, after going undefeated through four fights in Ottawa. The first guy I beat there, his name's Spencer Cunningham, and he's a year younger than me. He's a couple inches taller, and he was national champion two years ago, too, and last year. And he's favored to win. There's a lot of people watching him. Hersher would have to defeat Cunningham a second time to capture the gold. I knew kind of what my competition was going to be, but I wasn't exactly sure. And then I just did my thing and it all worked out. The performance follows a bronze medal outing in 2013, and those closest to the young fighter say they were not surprised by his surge through the competition. Last year, um, he went too easy on his first fight, and he lost his first fight, and then he didn't lose a fight after that. So I knew what he could do from last year's performance. So last year he came away with a bronze at Nationals. I knew he, could, he was a contender for gold, absolutely. Right hand. One, two, three. We kind of knew when he won the first fight that he was, the worst he was going to do was silver. So, you know, that was great, great to see because he came out a little slow last year and it basically cost him the gold medal. Success on the mat, however, doesn't come without a lot of hard work. Uh, lots of training and it takes lots of dedication. Um, I train five days a week. Um, I come here three days a week, go to Taekwondo once a week and then MMA also once a week here. He's putting the time in, he's working hard. He doesn't complain, he just does what I ask and, and that's what it takes. It also takes the right approach mentally. Basically, I'm pretty relaxed until I get into the fight and then I'm just thinking, well, this is my ring and I own it, so if you're in there and I take you out. Having a national champion on the club is also a great source of pride for the Rocky Mountain Academy of Martial Arts. I've uh, been working with Tyson for quite some time. Um, I always knew he had a lot of talent, but uh, he was focused and he worked hard in the class and really put a lot of time into getting ready and it's, I was just blown away with his achievement. Now just three and a half years after beginning Muay Thai, Hersher's future has many options available within the sport. If he decides he wants to teach later on or he has the option to stay amateur, go pro, whatever. He has a huge amount of heart and he shows it every time he's on the mats. He will be successful at whatever he does because he has that kind of go-getter personality. For Go Kootenays in Cranbrook, I'm Blaine Evans.